This is the artistic impression of Uganda Industrial Research Institute, Yuri. It is being explained to the team from the Manifesto Implementation Unit of the Office of the President. The team is here for a Manifesto execution monitoring routine. As they are taken around, the impression is that there is value for money. We must really be very grateful to the brains behind this setup because all industrial sectors, training, have all been undertaken here or they'll be undertaken here. I think this is very great for any program of industrialization. The team leader wants more funding extended for the institute. This appeal is in line with that of the institute executive director, Professor Charles Kwesiga. And if we got adequate funding for just two years, we would not need government support after that. We would be self-sustaining and would even generate revenues for government. They need more money even to have other centers in other parts of the country. I think they should be assisted to have more centers of this and to develop this fully. And I wish even our universities could take a leaf from here. For now, it remains work in progress with the promising future projections. We are heading to uh, play our role, our mandate to incubate industry in Uganda, uh, have an impact on uh, our journey to full industrialization of the country. Uh, that's our hope, that's our dream, and that is with the, with the number that we are showing that can be done. Industrial development is one of the main highlights in the 2021 to 2026 NRM Manifesto. Uganda Industrial Research Institute is one of the establishments listed to drive the industrialization agenda. Henry Okrut, UBC.